love, you will love yourself and you will depend on only God's opinion. I know it ain't nothing easy about going through that. There's a baby in your womb, but you wasn't trying to do that. You take it out back if you knew that, but you ain't have a clue that. That time with your boyfriend that late night, when you thought you was making love, that you would make life. And I was feeling unfair, made it ain't like you ain't got a life. You would... What is the destiny of our youth? Are we ascending or descending? We say it's time. It's time for this generation to arrive, to elevate, to lead change the world under the theme elevation youth alive launches july 3rd through 7th in nassau bahamas five days of compelling drama destiny changing inspirational instructions plus life-changing music and intense worship witness an awesome drama and multimedia presentation by offspring here from world-renowned youth ministry specialist dr dave david b burrow dr miles monroe angie burrow urban d from crossover church in tampa florida and many others learn about purpose Destiny and leadership in special day and night sessions. Youth Alive wraps up with an awesome concert featuring DJ Counselor, Gospel Boy, and other surprise international guest artists. And finally, a boat cruise for all ages as we walk the seas. Kingdom style. Register now at bfmmm.com or call 242 461 6430 or email youthalive1 at bfmmm.com for more information. Yeah. learned thus far in life is that you may not have much of a say as to which cards are dealt to you but you do have some kind of control over what you will do with the cards that you have do you know what it's like to be face to face with a vision that is so big that you decide not to follow it because you don't know how you're going to possibly bring it to pass as long as you're being led by God, in whatever you do, I'll be by your side every step of the way. To the moon and the stars. I'm too far gone to be the one telling people how to change their lives, or to be some positive change maker. So you're going to walk out of here mid-semester and throw everything away? There's not a mountain that man has... We're going to launch the corporation whether you all believe in it or not, and where one door is closed. About ten more will swing open. Why waste your time operating in fear? You owe it to the people who believe in you to move forward and not to move in the spirit of fear. In such is life, people live all these years going to the same job, making other people rich. And they die in their poverty. You have a right to prosper, you have a right to succeed, you have a right to fun, you have a right to happiness, you have a right to good life. The Bible says in Jeremiah, I know the plans that I have for you, says the Lord, plans that are good, to give you a good end. I don't even care what kind of rough spots come with it, it's still good. You were not born as an experiment. That's why I always tell people that the greatest tragedy in life is not death, it's something worse than death, and it's life without a purpose. Pastor Dave Burroughs and Minister Corey Roll travel to Eleuthera March 25-28 for a time of ministry in several schools at the primary and high school level, including Rock Sound High, Palmetto Point High, Tappan Bay Primary, P.A. Gibson All Age in Hatchet Bay and North Eleuthera High. Hundreds of young people received ministry in music and spoken word, and many of the students made professions of faith and recommitment to Christ. The team wrapped up their ministry under the tent in Governor's Harbor for a youth night hosted by Oasis of Love Ministries. Many teens and young persons were prayed for and received ministry that we hope will bring forth fruit on the island of Eleuthera. Continue to pray for the support of our youth ministry as we reach, teach, pray, and inspire our youth. Men, I would like to take this opportunity to thank you for your overwhelming turnout and support of last month's Power Breakfast. It was so powerful and impactful that we had to do it again. 
and part two is scheduled for this coming Saturday under the theme, The Constitution, Law and Governance. And our guest panels will be the Honorable Speaker of the House, our very own Dr. Kendall Major, and two of the top legal minds, Minister Merritt Storr and Minister Vince Martin. Men, this is scheduled to happen this Saturday, April the 20th at 8 a.m. sharp. We need you to be present and accounted for, and we want you to bring just three things. Bring another brother, bring your appetite, and bring some questions. It promises to be powerful and impactful, and you don't want to miss it. your bags and prepare to join Dr. Miles and Ruth Monroe at the marriage event of the year, the International Leaders Tropical Marriage Retreat at the exclusive Atlantis Resort in beautiful Nassau, Bahamas, April 23rd to the 27th. Reconnect with your spouse, empty your heart, and join couples from around the world for informative sessions, hands-on workshops, and lots of fun. Rekindle the fire on a sunset harbor cruise. Enjoy a unique renewal of vows ceremony. And finally, dance the night away at the exclusive Date Your Spouse Banquet. The cost, $995 per couple, with payment options available. For additional information and to reserve your spot today, contact us at 242-461-6445 or 461-6471 or via email at bfmconferences at gmail.com. Invest in your marriage today. Welcome, Kingdom citizens, to another Kingdom News Update. I'm Eva Brown with this week's announcements. Congratulations from the Kingdom Marriage Enrichment Ministry to Oscar and Brendalee Monroe, who are celebrating their 22nd wedding anniversary. May God bless your union and cause you to enjoy many, many more years of marital bliss. Do you want to have the best opportunity to stand out and make an impact? Do you want to chalk up a remarkable track record? Do you want to create a distinctive role for yourself, to create a strategy and a brand called you? Do you want to effectively influence and transform your community and your world for the better? Then join us on Thursday, April 18th at 7.30 p.m. here at the Diplomat Cafe for an exciting, enlightening, and a dynamic empowerment session featuring renowned motivational speaker, personal trainer, and comedian, Miss Shirley Pinder. Take this opportunity to embark on a journey to your brand new world. You will never be the same. Sunday, April 21st, has been designated as Law and Legal Professionals Day. On this day, BFM recognizes the importance of law to the orderly development of the Bahamian society. At this event, the following persons will be honored for their distinguished service to the wider Bahamian community. Mr. Godfrey Kelly, Dr. Peanut Maynard, Mrs. Ruby Nottage, and the late Honorable Paul Adderley. On Sunday evening, beginning at 7 p.m., there will be a panel discussion, including a period for questions and answers. Invite your family and friends to what we expect will be another memorable day as we honor the Lord and continue to build His kingdom. Persons interested in joining our follow-up program for new converts are invited to a special meeting on Thursday, April 18th at 7.30 p.m. in the Emmy Achara Boardroom. A special missions meeting is scheduled for Friday, April 19th at 7.30 p.m. here at the Diplomat Center upstairs in the North School. Persons interested in becoming a part of the missions team are welcome to attend. Persons scheduled to be baptized for April 27th at Goodman's Bay West are asked to attend a one-night baptismal class on Thursday, April 25th at 7.30 p.m. in the cafeteria. The following persons are asked to see Dr. Eldon Johnson in the Emmy Achara Board Room immediately after service today. Catherine L. Brainan, Keva J. Bridgewater, Franklin Butler, Karis Major, Pamela E. Rowe, Denisha Wilchcombe. Now for our youth announcements. All persons traveling on the Teen Mania Acquire the Fire trip and wish to purchase TYC t-shirts are asked to contact the youth office at 461-6430. Teen Leading Teen Seminar is scheduled for Saturday, May 18th, beginning 9.30 a.m. to 1 p.m. Young Champions Boys Club continue every Tuesday at 7.30 p.m. for young men ages 9 to 21. Transportation is available. 
please call the youth office at 461-6430. And TYC Stages and Meeting continue upstairs in the cafeteria every Sunday. This week at BFMI on Monday, April 15th at 7.30 p.m., plan to be a part of your Kingdom Prayer Congress. On Tuesday, April 16th at 7.30 p.m., there will be a Church Leadership Council meeting. On Wednesday, April 17th at 7.30 p.m., join us for our Midweek Kingdom Leadership Seminar. And on Sunday, April 21st at 10 a.m., plan to be a part of your Kingdom Citizen Celebration. Condolences go out to Avis Gibson and family on the recent passing of her sister, Ornette Thompson, who died suddenly, whom going to be announced. Condolences go out to Kenny Knowles and family on the passing of his mother, Minerva Knowles, whom going was held on Saturday Pass at Ebenezer Methodist Church. Please cover these families in prayer during their time of bereavement. Let us continue to pray for the complete healing of Ashley Storr, Beverly Cargo, Sandra Kemp, Joy Mullins, Cynthia Brennan, and Bert Mullins. Thank you, Kingdom citizens, for tuning in to another Kingdom News update. I'm Eva Brown, coming to you from the Bahamas, the place where God lives.